Hi everyone. Thank you for joining me here once again at Fluid Arts by Elsa. Tonight we're going to be working on another video and this time I am going to be working um, with some peacock colors. Uh, first, I do want to show you the video, uh, the dry piece from my previous video and I have it sitting right here. I'm going to show you uh, how that turned out. I am very happy with the results. The colors just pop. Um, it has a lot of shine and um, let me show you. So this is the piece that I did in my previous video and check out how gorgeous it turned out. A lot of people said it looked whimsical. It looked pretty and playful and I think so too. I love how it dried, right? Um, I think the composition is great. Love the black background. Check how that paint shimmers. And yeah, there it is. I am super happy with this one. I am going to finish it off with a top coat of resin. And I will show you how that turns out. But I wanted you to see how beautiful this piece turned out. Uh, tell me what you think. Tell me if you like it. I love it. And yeah, it is available for purchase. At, um, if you're interested, just email me at elsasgallery at gmail.com. Uh, next, I am going to show you what we're going to be working on. We are again are going to be working on the same size canvas. And I believe, uh, I don't have my, let's see. I'm going to tell you right now, hold one second. I'm going to tell you what size canvas this is. Give me one moment. So let's measure this real quick and we'll see 24, so 18 by 24 inch. And I already have my canvas prepped, as you know. Um, and I'm gonna show you. We are gonna be working tonight, like I said, with peacock colors. So this is my inspiration for tonight's video. I'm gonna show you the colors that I have lined up. They are quite a few colors. And again, the feathers may be different colors for some. I did try to get as close as I could to the colors that I see here. Um, and they're all different, right? So let's have fun. Meet me down at the canvas. Okay, guys, so here we are. We're down at the canvas. I still have my feather here because, I, again, I want to show you the colors that I'm going to be using, okay? So I'm going to place it right here. And I'm going to just, okay, I'll hold it. Oh, well, you can see it. I'll just place it down right here. And I'm going to show you the colors and then I'm, we're going to layer them. So I am going to be starting with, and again, this color I only see around the border. It is Pearl Lilac by Arteza. Okay, so I'm going to use that color to start with. I am going to add Lamp Black by Amsterdam. Okay. My next color will be turquoise blue and this is by artist loft then i'm adding windsor blue by windsor and newton next i have pearl turquoise by arteza i am adding olive green deep by amsterdam i'm following that by 24 karat gold by deco art and finally, iridescent green blue by Pavel. And those are my colors. This is my inspiration. And you could look at the feather, look at the colors. Okay, this is my inspiration. And a wonderful viewer of mine that suggested the peacock colors. This one is for you. And I am working once again with a black base, my flow acrylic black 
by Artist Loft. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead, get started, flood my canvas, and I'll be right back. I haven't thought about how I want to put the colors down. This is what you got to watch out for. This is what you see me pull out. Um, you don't want that drying in your paint. we're gonna go ahead and get started so let me just quickly think how I want my colors okay I'll put it right down the center okay so we're gonna start again with the pearl lilac by Arteza I did mention my colors all the colors are gonna be listed in the description box below We're going to try that. Now we're going to add, I don't want to add a smidge of black um, because we have black on the base. So I'm going to substitute with a little silver, okay? So silver by Pavel instead of black because we have black already down. Silver. Now turquoise blue by Artist Loft. I haven't used this color in a while. Now we have Windsor Blue by Windsor Newton. So this dark blue for contrast. And I am loading this on because as you see, I see that the colors, it's, the base is eating it. So I'm adding a little more of that blue. Okay, I think that's enough. I don't know how this is gonna work blowing it out, but we'll we'll see what happens. Now I have Pearl Turquoise by Arteza. Again, I'm gonna load it on. As I'm doing this, I'm just thinking how I'm gonna blow this out. Now Olive Green Deep by Amsterdam. Now 24 karat gold by Deco Art, and I haven't been using 24 karat gold as often as I did. I will be happy to see this in here today. Okay, and finally we have 
Iridescent Green Yellow by Pepe. Those are my colors. They have been layered down. Um, I wanna show you once again, there's a feather. Look against the colors. I think it works. I like it. Move my colors out of the way. And I'm gonna torch my colors. And now we're going to figure, guys, how we're going to blow out these colors. Because I have no idea how I'm going to blow out this looking X shape. Okay? But let's hope for the best. So here we go. Let me think. I'm going to start here. Okay, that worked. Let's try here. I'm gonna go down. Okay, beautiful. Let's go here now. Gorgeous. And last one. Wow, 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 wow. This is beautiful. Love it, love it, love it. Super happy. And I don't think there's much that I need to do here at all. I'm going to come over here and I'm going to blow on this corner here. I'm going to just bring this in just like that to connect. Soften that corner there. Oh, this is gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Love it. Okay. Let me come around right over here. Just want to blow over here. Oh boy, I am super happy.
I'm going to fix this over here a little bit, but I'm going to do that off camera just because I don't want my head in your way. And I'm going to clean up my edges and I'm going to I'm going to bring you down for a close up. Okay, everyone. So here we are. I already went ahead and cleaned up my edges. <clears throat> Look how gorgeous this turned out. The blues and the greens, the turquoise with the black background are just, it, this is just a stunning piece. Take a look at the cells and the lacing. Look at that shine as I move through these petals. Sorry about the glare and the lights. I did dim down the lights so that you wouldn't see so much of the light reflecting off this black canvas. But um, this is as much as I can do here. So look how those colors branch out. Check out that green, the irid iridescent green yellow. Just absolutely stunning. Look at these petals. This is gonna have so much shine to it. Love the depth of the colors and the pop of the green, how it lightens it. The silver's also in there. The gold by 24 karat. The pearl. So this outlining here, and as you look through the petal, that's that pearl, how it outlined, the pearl lilac. And I can't wait to see how this one is going to dry. Look how gorgeous. It is absolutely amazing. What do you guys think? Look at the feather here. Take a look at the colors now. Look at the colors. In, look at the colors in comparison to the black, uh, to the background colors that I chose. And I think I came pretty close to matching this peacock feather to the colors that i chose what do you think guys leave the comments below if you haven't subscribed and you like what you see don't forget to click the subscription button and also click the notification button that way you're notified anytime i have new content out thank you for joining me here at fluid arts by elsa and i'll see you guys in the next video Bye.